MHT update. Hello everyone, this is Mark with MHTAlerts.com bringing you your tropical update for today, August 6, 2012, where now all eyes are on Hurricane Ernesto, which uh, was a tropical storm and is still a tropical storm, but will be updated here in the next few hours as a Hurricane Category 1. So taking a look at the latest models and paths, which will also be updated on Google Earth here shortly, uh, which do show the latest update taking it straight into Belize. Uh, right now there are tropical storm or hurricane watches and warnings for Belize and Honduras showing watches for the northern part of Honduras which may only actually see high winds and uh, some rain maybe not much uh, of uh, anything to worry about except again for those folks in Belize need to keep a close eye on this uh, for the next day or so so taking a look at tropical storm Florence which is now tropical depression Florence is not much left out of that storm so I'd like to bring up the National Hurricane Center so we can take a look at the latest update. The latest update is as of 2 p.m. Eastern Daylight Time. The advisory number 20 alpha max sustained winds are 55 knots or 65 miles per hour. Minimum central pressure is 996 millibars located at 16.2 uh, degrees north and 81.1 degrees west. And again, we're going to take a look at the Mr. Hurricane Tracker site which is mhtalerts.com. We see the updated path for Ernesto, and again, as you see here, it has been updated, it looks like as a hurricane, and as you go down, you also see Tropical Depression Florence. But again, this is Tropical Storm, or Hurricane Ernesto, which has been updated with the warnings and watches, and I'll go over those in just a moment. And we go down a little bit and see the updated information as of August 6th today, it says Ernesto continues to move west through the Caribbean Sea and will pass close to the north coast of Honduras before crossing the Yucatan Peninsula into the Gulf of Campeche. Ernesto will cross far south of Gulf of Campeche to make landfall on Friday. It says regional warnings and hurricane warnings and updates have been posted right here on the bottom so you can take a look at that yourself and uh, see the fact that there looks like they're showing at least three to five inches of rain locally in some areas of Honduras so definitely the folks in Honduras need to keep a close eye on this again in the next couple of days so again I want to thank everybody for watching as we go back up and take a look at the latest uh, radar loop here on MHGAlerts.com a very good uh, radar loop of the storm and I'll post the link in the description of the video below as well for uh, the uh, website and also the Facebook as well so again, I want to thank everybody for watching. Please rate, subscribe, and comment. Have a great day.